Good morning, everyone. Despite billions of dollars and 20 years of war in Afghanistan, many of the servicemen said we never actually achieved our goals. In fact, we were far from it. Majority of the long-term service members enrolled shortly after September 11th. They felt that they needed to serve their patriotic duty and hit back hard the heart of the enemy, which has caused so much pain back home. Instead, they were faced with bureaucracy, inaccurate intelligence, and their assumption that American military and political systems would work anywhere, any place. Many of them said, despite our good intentions, we should have realized back, even back in 01 that we needed to change our military strategy. We needed to change the way we start a government in a different country. It needs to be adapted to the country, to the culture, to the language, to the people. If we had started with that strategy from 01, we would likely have seen more success than we have after we left. Here's a great comment from a service member who served in 2020 and 2021. When COVID shut down Afghanistan in March of 2020, it seemed like it was a relief. He said, sweet, now we don't really have to see them anymore because of COVID. We're just going to video teleconference or VDC and FaceTime and just do all our advising through WhatsApp, texting and video calls. Ultimately, it was a nail in the coffin. What started out as an already disorganized, disinformed strategy became more and more lax as we distanced ourselves from the culture and the people. As always, feel free to subscribe. Just couldn't keep you updated with the situation.